the Ford dealers of America, who sell and service Ford cars and Ford trucks, present Burr Tilstrom, creator of Kukla, Ali, and all the Kuklapolitan players with Fran Allison in Kukla, Fran, and Ali. Good evening. Good evening, television friends everywhere. Tonight uh, marks another milestone in the Kuklapolitan Art Theater and Light Opera Group, because tonight we are going to present for the second time um, our second annual uh, presentation of that classic light opera by those famous gentlemen, uh, Gilbert and Sullivan, the Macaro. Well, I'm glad to hear all your plaudits because I know that you, those of you who remember the Mercado from last year, remember what a gay triumph it was. And uh, we are doing this by popular request also because it is programmed for today. <coughs> it is something that we, we all feel that is very important uh, to bring to the public uh, are these fine light operas. And uh, we hope that uh, Mr. Shostanoff is watching tonight and uh, some of our friends in New York, also Mr. Field in Cleveland, uh, who will appreciate one of the numbers, I'm sure, a special one dedicated to him. <coughs> it is through, uh, I beg your pardon, I'm getting to the credits. <laughs> uh, we're terribly sorry we could not uh, run the credits on the screen tonight, but when we timed them, we found it took longer than the show, so we had to dispense with them. Uh, so I am going to make uh, the credits, besides that, uh, the there's a little uh, uh, thing that we used to whirl them past the camera. I broke a gear. Uh, the transmission wasn't greased properly, and it, it broke a gear. And uh, we had a little difficulty, I think, with the, with the gears. So uh, we are dispensing with the regular credits. <coughs> uh, oh, yes. <coughs> uh, it is through the efforts of uh, the Kuklapolitan. This is a combined effort of the Kuklapolitan Art Theater Light Opera Company. Kukla Pollen Opera Company, uh, I'm getting to it, a ladies' string trio and the ladies' auxiliary uh, choir of the Kukla Pollen Strolling Carolers Society Blues and uh, uh, the Kukla Pollen Philharmonic Society and uh, uh, the Kukla Pollen Ladies' Auxiliary String Trio and uh, Mr. Jack Fascinato. Those, I believe, um, are the whole combination. And, oh yes, and uh, the Cecil Bill Stagehands Union, <coughs> local Kukla Um uh, <laughs> I would like you to see how thoroughly we have prepared here for this great classic tonight. I would like to take a glimpse around the studio and see uh, the tense excitement of all the people who are connected. May we see around? Uh, there you are, you see. Even off uh, stage, which you do not ordinarily see. We have people all waiting. Look at Jack Fashionado. He's tense. Hello there, Jack. Hello, uh, tense. A little tense, aren't you? How are your knuckles? Pretty good. Fine, that's good. And uh, up there on the back, you see, right beyond the, well, about the fourth Japanese landing, is uh, Dean Boynar, our boom boy. Would you mind bowing, please, Dean? Thank you very kindly. The broad... Good heavens, what's that running down his hat? Oh, I beg your pardon. I think you have the wrong costume. The, the broad expanse that you see facing the camera to the right is um, the uh, young man who operates our uh, camera and also an authority on the Mikado. Uh, he operates our zoom, our lens. Uh, would you mind just turning your profile, please, Mr. John Casagranda? I'll do. <coughs> Very oriental type fellow. Now, uh, we'll, let's pan right and we can see the entire expanse of the studio. Oh, there I am. Hello there. Uh, you can see the stage in its entirety. It's quite a... Uh, oh? Those feet that are protruding are... Uh, perhaps you have never before seen on television. They belong to the young star of our lovely show. Uh, oh, I was mistaken. It's Martha Ray. <laughs> <laughs> the young man of uh, Linwood, Linwood boy, uh, on your toes, uh, about ready uh, to start now. All set. Mm -hmm. Well, I believe we have seen everything that's ready, and uh, you can come back to me now if you will. No, I don't believe that anymore. I'm getting to it. 
Well, cut the first course if you have to. I'm entitled to make a speech. I don't have a part. Beg your pardon. In a moment now, we are going to sound a gong for the overture to... Uh, oh, may I remind you that uh, we are treating the Mikado rather loosely. Uh, I'm ashamed to say, but uh, the original script was lost and we only had some selections from it, uh, the Mikado, and so we kind of have to make up the story as we go along. Uh, but we've all studied very hard. As a matter of fact, one lady who is playing a leading role uh, has studied so hard that uh, she can't do it without her book. So if you see the book, you'll understand. Well, I guess we're all ready to go, so let's have the overture to the Mikado. <laughs> Catashaw, and so I have escaped, looking for my friend, 
Yum yum, whom I knew at school. But meanwhile, I am just a wandering minstrel. A wandering minstrel, I a thing of shreds and patches, of ballad songs and snatches, and dreamy me My catalog is long through every passion ranging, and to your humors changing, I tune my supple song. I tune my supple song. Are you in sentimental mood? I'll sign with you. Yum, 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 yum. Does it taste good? Oh, cool. Uh, <clears throat> you... <laughs> Thank you. Honestly, I thought ears were about it. <clears throat> so you would seek yum, yum. Do you not know that she has been away at school with her two friends, Pity Singh and Beat Po, and they are coming back today? Oh, yes, I heard that, and that is why I'm here, to seek her hand in marriage. Her hand in marriage? <laughs> that is a laugh. Ha 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 ha. That is indeed a laugh. Why so? Pray tell me. Because she is promised to Coco, who is now the Lord High Executioner. What's he got that I haven't got? Well, I just see as a matter of fact. Well, he has a 50 Ford. Oh? Convertible. Oh? And as a matter of fact, this is supposed to be a secret, so please don't tell Yum Yum. No, I won't. You see, it's to be his wedding gift to her. Oh? How do you know all this? Well, I'm the Ford dealer for the town. <laughs> is that so? Yes, indeed. Oh, I, I didn't know that. Poobah, Ford dealer. Yes, Poobah Agency. We have quite a wonderful business here. All the whole town is just crazy about the 50 Ford, you know. How could you help but be crazy about the 50 Ford? It's so beautiful. Have you ever test-driven a 54? Oh, no, I am but a poor and, and lonely minstrel. Little does he know that I am the son of the, of the Mikado, and I am the prince, and I have uh, 17 54s at home, but I cannot tell him this. What were you saying? I was just a soliloquy, never mind. Oh, yes, the 54 is designed and built for beauty, comfort, for performance. That low, road-hugging ride. Feel the comfort of the new foam rubber seat cushion and the extra wide comfort style doors. Oh, that just, you should test ride the 54. You've practically sold me. If I just had some money, perhaps if I sing a few more songs. Wait here, I want to show you something. Oh, how beautiful! 
And you bet. This is the little 54 convertible that uh, Coco is giving yum yum. Oh, I stand nary a chance. Nary a chance with this gift. Well, see what I told you? Awfully sorry, but I'd be glad to do business with you. Be glad to, uh, perhaps, uh, perhaps if you offered her a Ford uh, 54 convertible and a 54 uh, station wagon, that might do it. Well, I'll sing a few more songs and see. Well, whenever you're in the market, here's my card. Thank you. I'm just down the road a piece. You'll see the showroom. What a pity. Oh, alas, alas, and today they are coming home from school. The three little maids. Well. Hark, what do I see coming down the road? The three little maids. Oh, I must hide. Why can't I let them find me like this? Francis. I see <laughs> Oh, oh, yum, yum, darling. It's so oh, nice to see you. Isn't it lovely to be home? Oh, it's so lovely to be home with you. What are you going to do this summer? What? What are you planning to do this summer? Oh, I'm just going to uh, ride, I guess, and some touring. You're going to ride? Mm -hmm. Where is, um, where is Pity C? Where is she always? Where is it? Pete Bo? I never know her name. <laughs> well, where in the world Bebo is she? Pa pardon? Pete Bo! Pete Bo! Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> oh, this was to have been such a happy day. When do you think Un Beldi? I'm You're in the wrong show, Ollie. I'm Lieutenant Pinkerton. You're no such a thing. <laughs> not? Well, not in this, you aren't. Aren't you Madam Butterfly? No, I'm... <laughs> oh, good gracious, what a horrible mistake. Now, you see, he's... Who am I? This the... What's this? What show is it? The Mikado. The Mikado? Oh, the Mikado! Well, wait a minute. I'll go back to the costume room. <laughs> yeah. I'll be back in a second. I you, think... You just go look a while. This is a sad day. A very sad day. This was the day I had hoped so to see Nanky Poo. He was such a wonderful boy. He was the, the leading man on the campus. <laughs> Nanky Poo! Yes. Is it really it's you? It's really me, yes. Well, how came you here? Well, I came here... Oh, dear. Well, I've heard all about Coco and everything. Oh, yes. If you would only marry me. Could oh. you marry me? No, I... Oh, I would that I could. But he's given me a 50 Ford convertible. I have news for you. I am the son of the Mikado. I can give you a, a 50 Ford in every color and every shape and every size. Well, I know. Well, perhaps I'd better start on this. Now, I have one red one. How, what have you? I have a... I have a beautiful, beautiful green one. I, I thought I heard someone say you had 17. I do. If I could get a pure canasta in red and one in green, I'd have another to start on. Well, <clears throat> oh ho! So I... What's the matter? <laughs> Your aerial is down. Oh, I see you together. Oh, here's a fine thing. <laughs> Here's a how de do if sh That song has been deleted from this rendition. I'll have to change the words. <laughs> Captain Video, if I marry you, when your time has come to perish, then the maiden whom you cherish must be slaughtered too. Captain Video. Boy, have you lost Captain your mind? Well, they wouldn't be watching us anyway. <laughs> it's all at the same time. <laughs> Please, Ollie, honestly. Now, let's get back to the story. We'll have to skip a whole bunch because we're late, because you got the wrong costume on. Well, we skip. I'll go while you find your part. Well, I just... I just... All right. Sing Tip Willow. Okay. Just that allows everything up for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> on a tree by a river, a little Tom Tit sang Willow, Tit Willow. It's willow. And I said to him, Dickie Bird, why do you sit singing willow? Tit willow, tit willow. Is it weakness of intellect, birdie? I cried, or a rather tough worm in your whistle inside? With a shake of his poor little head, he replied, Oh, willow, tit willow, tit willow. Thank you, Pooh. You better tighten it up. I've got to marry her sometime. You may marry Yum Yum. Yum Yum? Yes. You may, we may be married. Coco has given us permission. Oh, isn't that wonderful. And I shall be like the, like the shining sun, and you will be at my side. And I shall be the moon. Yes. And shine in your reflected glory. Oh. Observe his flame, that placid dame, the moon's celestial highness. There's not a trace upon her face of diffidence and shyness. She borrows light that through the night mankind may all acclaim. And truth to tell, she lights up well, so I for one don't blame her. Ah, pray make no mistake, we are not shy, we're very wide awake, the 
come on and I Oh, pray make no mistake We are not shy We're very wide awake The moon and I That truly is a beautiful song. Hi. Well, it's happened. I have to marry Cattershaw. Well, oh, why not worry? Are you, Yum Yum? No, not at all, because we'll all live together. Why, certainly, with the flowers that bloom in the spring. Yes, that's exactly right. We have me fun. 196. The flowers that bloom in the spring, tra la, pra, give promise of merry sunshine. Right. We welcome, they hope that they bring, tra la. What comes next? I'm, uh, uh, I've got to take it under my. No, uh, wait a minute. <coughs> Let's start. Of a summer of roses oh, and wine. That's it. And that's what we mean when we say that a thing is welcome as flowers that bloom in the spring. Tra la 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 la, tra la 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 la, the flowers that bloom in the spring. Tra la 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 la, tra la 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 la. Flowers that bloom in the spring, tra la, have nothing to do with the case. I've got to take under my wing, tra la, a most unattractive old thing, tra la, with a caricature of a face, with a caricature of a face. And that's what I mean when I say or I sing. Oh, bother the flowers that bloom in the spring. Tra la 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 ha, tra la 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 ha, oh, bother the flowers of spring. Thank you, thank you very much. Did you bow now? I guess we just bow. Well, how does it end? I don't know. You got the wrong costume. No, I can much. find out. There's only one thing I can say right now. May I say it, please? Oh, yes, go ahead. Remember, <clears throat> for Nanky Poo and Yum Yum and Coco, it's the 50 Ford. <laughs> It's performance like this, reliable, trouble-free performance on good roads and bad that makes the big new Ford the one fine car in the low-price field. And behind that flashing power and all-around roadability, there's real economy, too. Economy of initial cost, economy of operating cost, economy of upkeep. Tomorrow, see your neighborhood Ford dealer and inspect the new Ford. Check it for economy. Then take the wheel and test drive the new 1950 Ford. On behalf of Nike Poo and Yum Yum and all the cast of the Mikado and Colonel Cracky, this is Bert Hilstrom thanking you and saying good night. Remember, before you buy any car at any price, First test drive, the one fine car in the low price field, the 1950 Ford. Kupla, Fran, and Ollie came to you from Chicago. NBC Television.